Next, we're going to have uh, K. with the state representatives, 
we won that resolution and we even had a few Republican supporters on it. So the crisis is deep and it's the basis of the ability to build the movement. Um, I'd like to say that I think that we can't be too bold, um, that we've learned that. Um, one of the things that uh, we found, for instance, when we called for the sit-ins at Yunnan and Louisville, Kentucky, um, we saw that there was a kind of a magnetic generation of support from people who'd been kind of sitting back, that the idea of militant action was indeed um, hopeful to people, and that people came out of the woodwork as we marched on the corporate headquarters of Humana. And uh, it was one of the strangest experiences I ever had. We prepared people to go to jail, and we had a group that was willing, and then another group that was going to come in with us and stay until the police came and were going to uh, take us out. And what we found was that Humana was afraid of the arrest and the public publicity that would come from that. So we found ourselves with 75 people in the marble rotunda of Humana for 24 hours. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, you know, to those of you who went to jail, uh, we thank you and uh, we tried. <laughs> Um, I'd like to say uh, briefly, I know there's been some debate about um, we now need to move to a strategy of state by state. And I would like to say something in relationship to that. I believe that maintaining the national movement and the pressure on the Congress at the national level is absolutely essential. Let us work with our brothers. Yeah. <laughs> Let us work with our brothers and sisters within the state movement, but quite frankly, there's nothing automatic about passing it in the state, making it then pass on a national level without that national movement that is able to lead the way. And we have all kinds of progressive programs that have gotten stuck at the state level. We have workers' comp at different levels. There are fights over that all the time. You know, we have public employee bargaining that we battle all the time. So we need this national movement working with those who work on the state movements, but making sure that we continue to build what we've already done. And um, last point? OK. Um, last point, I think that once this current bill either passes or doesn't pass, that we should not say it's going to be 10 years or a generation right, right. or whatever. That's right. Woo! Yeah. The crisis, the crisis is intense and will worsen and the suffering will continue That's the right. day after the bill is passed. There will be no relief and that will be the basis of continuing to make this movement go and um, we should be bold and labor's the key and we're going to win.